Hi, welcome to Ben's Astrophotography. Tonight I'm going to challenge iPolar with a big obstruction in its field of view, including the Polaris. So let's see how it works. I'm starting the iPolar. The red cross, which is the rotation center of my RA axis, appears right away on the screen. And there's a red dot, meaning the virtual north pole. You may wonder why there's only five stars on the left-hand side of the screen. I will show you. Okay, I uh, pull out a raw image and uh, you can see there's a brick wall, which is uh, the wall of my house. And I'm using my mobile phone to light it up. And uh, as you can see, it's really a, a solid wall covering almost half of the sky. Okay, I will turn it back to the enhanced star view. There's still five stars and the plate solve is successful because we see the red dot there. And next, I will try to move the red dot closer to the red cross to uh, complete the polar alignment. When the red dot and the red cross are close enough, the center of the screen will be automatically magnified. And this is a very good visual aid because my hands are on the scopes, but still I can see how it goes from a distance. The only thing about having five four stars for place solving is that the virtual North Pole is kind of jumpy in the uh, enlarged view. It's not as stable as having 10 stars on both sides, especially with the Polaris. I guess that's also related to a below average seeing we have tonight. But still, I'm completing a reasonably good polar alignment without seeing the Polaris in my field of view, which I'm pretty happy with. I think this is a very important feature because for us backyard astrophotographers, our house or the trees around our backyards can be a very important concern of where we can put our scopes. So if we can do a polar alignment without seeing the Polaris, and this will give us much more flexibility as where to put our scopes in our backyard to have better view of different parts of the sky. All right, that's it for this iPolar challenge. Thanks for watching. See you next time.